What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. This is the Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris, and with me, as always, is my buddy Mike. What's going on, Chris? Man, Mike, you, we did it, man. Fear the Walking Dead Season 3 finale. This is man, episodes brutal. episodes 15 and 16. Yes. Uh, damn it, we did it. All right, look, we went through it. All right, I don't know I don't know what you want to know. I don't know, I don't know what you want to say to you about it, all right? We did it. We're troopers. Okay, everybody, we're troopers. We did it. All right, look, um, here's the thing. I'm just gonna jump right into this. All right, let's. I just wanna for finale, uh, for finale, it wasn't bad. All right, um, you know we got the introduction of the the Proctors, I guess. Proctor. The, you know, um, he, this is okay. You get, you got these the, the introduction of these Proctors, this mm-hmm. Proc John, Proctor John and his biker gang, but we didn't know anything about him. Like th- we've never even heard of we. He was. Oh, other than brief mentions, and yes, it's a bit of a rant, yeah. but other than brief mentions, did we know? Oh, then all of a sudden, in the finale, you introduced this character. Well, I get. I guess they gave you a glimpse of that, and that's who. Um, remember when we? Can, I, what was it? Which episode was it? Uh, when when Strand. That was met the previous the episode, episode fourteen. Yeah. So he's like, I got something for Proctor John. Yeah. But my point is, and and I, but that was be, it. To be honest, I don't even remember maybe when they got to the bazaar on the first time because maybe they said Proctor John runs it. I don't remember that. I, I don't, don't know. remember. I don't remember hearing but, that. But I, that's what I'm saying. It's just weird that all of a sudden, oh, the, all of a sudden there's uh, this plot for them mobilizing. Yeah. Like what? Dude, all all I kept all I kept thinking when I saw him was I, mean, I know you'll know the remember the character, but who was Harry's uncle that it, from Harry Potter that turned into the wolf? Oh, it's Gary Oldham. Yeah, For, <laughs> kind of. I could be totally off, but I don't know if it was the hair or something like that. But yep. you know, I, I haven't seen the episode Harry Potter. I mean, the movie in, in a while. But yeah. I just for some reason that just came to me, and that's I was like laughing. He looks a little like a me. busted version of Gary Oldham. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It was. Don't knock was... Gary Oldham, man. That guy is amazing. I love that guy. Yeah. Um, anyway, yeah, dude. Whatever. So. The reason they're doing that, we'll talk about that reason in, in, at the end. You know, there's a there's a reason why these guys, and then they say something. Let's save that for the end for a little okay. sizzle. It's a little beginning yeah. sizzle. Yeah. Um, so they're harvesting adrenal glands. Yes, we get that right off the bat. Yes. <laughs> okay. With, with Nick. That was pretty crazy. Uh, that was, yeah, it was, that was it enjoyable. Was, yeah, obviously Madison realized too. Remember we had spoke about it that she realized right away that Nick was back into that shit. And obviously he was doing that for the fact that he was getting paid and and drugs too. So um yeah, it's it's tough with Nick because I told you last episode, I know you guys know already that I, I didn't like when Nick reverted back to this druggy yeah. kind of character. And it's kind of funny because uh, Troy kind of became that um like that good that good part of you know, trying to get that goodness into Nick again. I'm like, yo, this dude is like tripping me out and all this kind of stuff. And it's kind of sad what happened to him. But hey, you know what? It was it was it was pretty cool. We see Nick slicing through and 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 for for what reason? There was you know, some cool stuff like how the yeah. guy was pulling out the stuff. Like I like that. Um, and how he was explaining, you know, you got to get the good ones. This one's gone too too far, and you know. Yeah. How about uh, how about Strand? fucking setting them all up good old good old strand right oh strand. yeah well he's a conniver strand you, know, you just you, j- you can't you can't stop being strained i mean at least they kept him you know that that's his character so great but dude just well he had a good part i mean obviously he w- he was fucking um lola and and salazar but there was that that deal that he said that um, if you know you'll let my friends Madison her and her children. Yeah, he really he because he hates Daniel. He doesn't like yeah. Daniel. He thinks Daniel's a, a, you and he know. shoots him right in his face. Damn, dude. that was that was crazy. All right, so there was, was a, there were some parts of this, but I was like I was like oh damn. Yeah, it like, was okay, dude. It was okay. We've been it was okay. This fucking show. It, it actually wasn't. It, it wasn't, wasn't bad. Too bad. It wasn't it bad. Wasn't I mean, too bad. those two. I mean, I look at them as a whole, not as separate. Obviously, so it's like. Like, yeah. But as a finale, like, yeah, I mean, it wasn't that bad. Like, uh, there were some, like, again, there were some cool stuff. It's like when, when, mm-hmm. um, I don't even know the girl's name, but when, uh, Fel- Alicia, Felicia, Alicia, and the other girl, I call it pickaxe girl. Yeah, do we? I don't even think we got to do it. I don't, I don't think so. But when they got hit, um, and then attacked on the street, like that, that was, was that was unexpected. Like, that was oh, cool. Shit, you know, um, yeah, because she's trying to get her to cut her hair for um to sell it. 
to sell it yeah. for whatever the heck it was. I found maybe food, I guess it was. Well, I don't remember if they mentioned. Uh, so, oh, that. for anything, just for anything, they get they get gold. They get because she said something like, um, "If we get rid of that, we'll be good for a month or something." No, think- no, no. They said that she said that we'll be set. We'll be set for a long time, she says. Yeah. Oh, whatever it was. Yeah. So I don't know if that's food. Whatever that meant. Right. Whatever that meant. So according to the bazaar. So maybe like they would have been able to like eat for a year or weapons. What what is, what is, what did she explain what the hair is so valuable? I don't think she explained it, but I, I just automatically assumed like it's people making, they're making stuff with it or they're giving it to people. Who the hell knows? (laughs) <laughs> Obviously, they look that whole place making is rope. just making rope, you know, making dope. Who the hell knows what they're doing? <laughs> Cooking right. that, yeah. Um, we did, yeah, we was, did, it was fucked up with that crash, though. We that did get, good. we did get, um, Madison vouching again. She just, she just can't help herself. She's got a vouch, but then what happens is she, so she mm-hmm. vouches for Troy and then she ends up killing him. I guess she did it before uh, Salazar would eventually get his hands on him. Dude, but that was that you was know? another one that I was like, oh! <laughs> I know. It was kind of fucked up because he seemed like he was... Um, I, I mean, I don't necessarily think it was an act by Troy because we had spoken before about how his, his character changes. So his character changed so much that yeah. um, it almost seemed... Uh, it almost seemed... T- t- <laughs> too much. You know what I mean? It seemed too much... And I was wondering if if it was kind of an act. I don't know. Sorry. I just got to tell you when that happened, my wife actually watched this with me. I was like, can you watch, you want to watch this with me? She's like, fine. I'll watch it. She sat there making fun of it the whole time. But when she blasted Troy in the face, Oh my God. Angie goes, Angie goes, Angie goes, shut your slut mouth. (laughs) (laughs) You shut your slut mouth. After she hit him, it was fucking hilarious because she hits him once. And then she says, you shut your slut mouth. And then in the, and then she hits him oh, that second funny. time. Oh, dude, I was dying. I wrote it they down. Had, I'm laughing had, my ass off. <laughs> and then Nick's like, Mom, that was my only friend. And then he like turns around like, what, what the fuck, dude? This bitch is crazy. But oh, my God. How about the awkward hand touching when they were setting up the... The, um, oh, he because he's because he doesn't right? have a mo- like t- he's weird. He just like yeah. But did you see? I saw that more like hey baby. Yeah, exactly. That's I think he was like hey Not baby motherly, like motherly. No, know? no, 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 no. Wait, no. Who touched who again? She touched him. Remember when they were planning the? the no, no. The, I know that. But who who did the touching? Uh, Troy put his hand, hand on, on hers. hers. Yeah, that's what yeah. I'm saying. He was like insinuating to her. He's like, hey, we got a couple minutes here. Yeah. And she's like, gross. Yeah, shut, your, was, sl- shut your slut mouth. It's bitch. like, are we okay? Are we good? <laughs> yeah, like, whatever. Look, point is, good, good for him. All right, they yeah. got a yo. Lola got shot in the head. Mm-hmm. Like, lots of things happened in this man. Like, um, yeah. Can, can we just? Uh, I just, uh, man. Can we go to Alicia? Let's go back to Proctor John for a second. Yeah. This whole subplot of, oh, she gets taken by these by the bad guys who we actually just found out were bad guys. Yeah. And, and now she like, they, they, they just couldn't help themselves. They had to put Alicia with the bad guys. Right. Like, that's oh. my point. Like you re- it's so typical. You put one of the characters with the bad guys. And then when the bad guys go to where the good guys are, that character, the good guy character is there. And you're like, Oh, Hey, um, it's not what it looks like. Like, come on. And then strand sees, and I guess he understood when she went over there, but she helps with this weird surgery. And then another point is this guy has a surgery and then he's just up. I know. He gets right up. We, the he goes on all, a boat. We, we see him. Yeah, we see him in a wheelchair right off the bat. And then they do this. They remove this this tumor from his, his spine or his back or whatever. And like you said, yeah, right after that, he leans up. And, and how about the fact that Alicia's <laughs> automatically like this fucking doctor? Like, oh, can you wiggle your toes? Why? Oh. Be, exa- why? Because she I was, set- a, I was a fucking uh, volunteer at a hospital uh, for a, a bunch of, you know, a bunch of years from from being from a kid. You know, like give me a fucking break. You know what I mean? I just thought that they made her. That's what I'm well, saying. You know your way around the the operating room, little girl. Yeah. All of a sudden, this guy's like, "Yeah, you were able to. You, you wrapped up a broken leg, right? And now, and where is that girl? Yeah. Just I don't even. Maybe maybe I wasn't paying attention. When the hell did they even get? Where were they? Was that the bazaar? Like I don't even know where that. I don't. I must have blacked no, out. That, that was. That How'd they was, get there? 
I they did Proctor. The, uh, that's true. How the hell did they get there? Because Alicia, she's wrapping up her fired, leg. No, but Alicia fired the gun right after they got. After they got um, how did they get from um on the street what, to to, to Proctor the, John? I don't remember. Can I don't miss? know. Can anyone tell us? I'm not going back to watch it. I don't care. So you can no. tell us in the comments. But, but anyway, I don't know how they did it, dude. Like, where the hell did? They... That's true. The next thing I know, I guess I was looking at my phone or I was writing down notes, and then all of a yeah. sudden, she's got maybe the girl jumped, on the thing. Maybe they just jumped it quick, and because for both of us to have missed that, I don't think that I we. Don't know, man. It, it that. is dumb. But regardless, Alicia's helping out, and they and they get this, they get Proctor John up, and and within, however, you know, it didn't seem like a long time. Now this guy is walking around and he's sneaking in so they can attack uh, attack the, the dam. Can we yeah, can we talk? I, can we go there for a minute? Sure. Man, I mean, talk about red shirts from Star Trek, right? Like you, <laughs> you really, there are guys shooting at you, and you're just yeah. gonna run out of a door. I'm just gonna run out of a door and just pop, 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 pop. No, 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 no. Bit, You're not gonna just run blindly out of a door. Well, the funny part is, what is, the is they, uh, they, they plan the attack after Nick and after Troy first initially came and said, "Hey, listen, these these dudes are coming." Um, Salazar's like, All right, "Anybody that wants to leave, leave right now. Otherwise, you're staying and fighting." So there's such a huge advantage by having this um, dam and this and this high space that they can shoot down at anybody that's coming up to them or you know i just felt like like you said these you know these these you know these damn the damn workers these, these damn, damn people. fighters yeah uh, they have guns. It was just so easy i just felt like the advantage was just re- it should it have been there was no advantage on their point there it was, was the guys that were in a single file mikey the guys in I a know. single file on a yep. on a catwalk and they're running right toward. And, and they're running like, boop, 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 out boop, boop, of boop, doors boop. right into them. <laughs> like what the like? So I don't. I hate. I, I hate it. I hate it. I hate I when they do that. So yes, this was this was a decent finale, but there were yeah. just these things, and that's what that's the problem again with this show. I've said it. I've said it for the past three years. That's the problem with this show. They yeah. just do dumb things. Why do you yeah. have to have them do dumb? things? things if these people have survived wow. the apocalypse thus far then they're gonna go out like that anyway i can't whatever so yeah. whatever good for them they're dead they killed a lot they killed basically everybody but the regulars um yeah. and good well how about how about after how about after all this and strand is sneaking madison and and nick out and mm-hmm. they're walking down up in, you know to you know to, to exit strands gonna let them leave somehow whatever oh that whole whichever. thing oh my god and then they mm-hmm. and they reach this group of these proctors and strands like oh well uh you know proctor john told me uh, i'm gonna take care of these he guys wants me like, to take care of them and like, the guy's just like okay all right you know sure, like, you, didn't ahead, just, you. you didn't just double cross us you didn't tell us that uh you know. <laughs> Yeah, I just thought that was a little, little um, like really, ridiculous. you know. And then that whole thing, yeah. And then like, so, oh my god, the whole back end was just like, okay, somebody do something. Then it's twenty wow. minutes of Nick holding the thing. Yeah, I actually didn't mind that too much. No, I, mean, I know, I didn't, I didn't either. But at the same time, like, he's gonna go sacrifice himself. I mean, I don't know, man. The whole thing is. He's gonna sack. He's like, I'm just gonna do it. I'm done. Like all of a sudden, you're done now. Like, what- let, well, let me ask you this. Yeah, what did you think about that? What if, what if he did? I mean, because obviously at the end we don't necessarily know he if yeah. he's gonna die. Essentially, we with, think everybody. He was dead. with Salazar, and at right, the end, yeah. so I'm assuming both of them will survive somehow. But if Nick, um, just say for instance, he died, uh, def- uh, you know, definitely in that in that moment, how would you feel if we wouldn't have Nick on the show anymore? I wouldn't like it because uh, honestly, yeah. I think Nick is I think Nick is one of the stronger characters. I like his arc so far. I like where he's mm-hmm. come. I like he's he, you know you didn't like it when he fell off the wagon. I didn't like it either. But you know what? Yeah. That's true to character. How long can you really? I, I mean, hey, fight I, fight what's in you know your your yeah. your overall instinct or your yeah. your vices. So. You know, I think the show itself wouldn't be as and and then now and and they just they're continually they're continually making Alicia bring her to the forefront, and I don't know if that's because she's because she's on that show, The One Hundred, and and I don't watch that show. Mm-hmm. It looks it looks kind of cool. Mm-hmm. I watched the first like the pilot, and I wasn't into it at the time, but mm-hmm. it looked like it's gone a really interesting direction in the seasons 
um, since it started, but she's on that show too. Yeah. Or was on that show. I don't know. She could be dead. You guys could, if you're a fan of, um, uh, you know, Alicia, uh, I forget. What, how do you say your last name? Uh, Dun- Dunham Carey or something? Dunham Carey or something, whatever. Something if you're like a fan that. of hers, you know, you could let us know whether she's yeah. on there or not. Um, but anyway, yeah, yeah, I don't like, like, I don't, here's the problem. I don't know. None of these characters were strong enough to begin with anyway to carry weight, right? Except yeah. Nick. My opinion, season two, Nick helped carried that season and then you had daniel like those two characters carried the season strand sucks he's not he's not a strong character he's annoying and we've said it before madison they're all not for us you and i i think they're not strong enough now they could be i think it was tough time. it was it's tough since travis left the but show but even but that's my point travis wasn't strong either he was just I mean, as annoying i kind of liked i i didn't you know i kind of liked i kind of liked travis i couldn't some, stand some I, stuff son. what was the son's name chris chris but again, that's my point. They were either really annoying or they barely carried <laughs> the group. Anyway, these characters for me weren't just, yeah. they're just not strong enough. You know, I, I you know, I don't want to look, I, I don't want to take anything away from them, but I just feel like the writing isn't as strong as it is on. Yeah. And, 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 and is that because we already have that material? Like the characters in the comic are already established. They have, so when yeah. you're, but you're creating, ca- like, it doesn't matter. Like you're creating characters, make them interesting. None of these characters well, are interesting. It's difficult, except it's Nick difficult. and Daniel. Uh, well, I've said this before. I mean, you, you know for sure. My feeling on this is it's so difficult making a, a, a spinoff of or a sister show of The Walking Dead because. But, but it's not. What, it's it's. I, I I understand what you're saying. Um, I understand the writers can. I think the writers can write gold, and it would be. Um, still very difficult for for people to to be captured by the show because we're just so it's like it's almost like you feel like you're cheating on someone it's like a loyalty to the original Mm -hmm. that's how i kind of feel i mean i don't know if anybody else kind of agrees with that so i just think that there's always a part of you that's like it's not the walking dead when you're watching this i mean yeah yeah i get i get it but I, I don't i really don't understand it's also why. it's also not filled with the greatest act uh, the, the greatest see the see, acting defend the acting see the acting isn't it's not so much the acting it's know. the writing dude it's I, it's it's the actual because think if you put someone that was a, a, a like a, a triple a actor but they're saying those words in those situations oh, like sure, yeah, mic malfunction here what happened you can keep going. You know what I'm saying? Like, what would yeah. what would what would the difference be? But anyway, I know we've talked enough about that. Let's. I just want to talk about. Um, there's a couple things I just want to mention. What did you think about the the stupid fucking interrogation? Like, I when he, I didn't like I didn't like how um, he locked the door on Nick. Well, um, right away you knew, man. That's supposed to show how. You know, he, I mean, he wanted to answer. He loves his daughter, yeah, and he's he's the you know yeah. this is what he did. This is where he came from. This is his background. So, uh, you know, I I didn't. He he can read Nick like a book, and he he saw through everything. Well, he's and good he at look. Was, he's good at what he does. That's yeah. that's the point. He so he, I mean, he had every right. He had every right, Salazar, to 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 interrogate Nick the way he did. Um, obviously, in the end, he still didn't get his. He still didn't get the answer. Well, Nick no, cries. he knew. He knew. I think he. Uh, I don't think he most likely really, he did. But anyway, Troy is now gone, so it doesn't nothing. matter. Well, I mean, I, I, that was like, I had, I had mixed feelings about that because I was like, yeah. oh, come, really, you're going to try and interrogate him now? But at the same time, I'm like, oh shit, he's going to interrogate Nick. Like, I really, I was really like, it was like a dual a duality yeah. of me. I was like, one part was like, damn, this is going to be cool. The other part was like, really? Just come on. Yeah, do like, you really you, have to you do that? You're going to torture me? You're going to cut my fingers yeah, off? Yeah, you know, but... Listen, um, I, I, for, for me, I think that I think that in the end, Nick maybe did trick him. Um, it was very easy for Salazar when he comes onto the bridge, onto the dam at the end. And yeah, he's, yeah. Maybe he would have shot Nick. I mean... I think he... I, I agree. I think you he know did. What I mean? so, so in the end, he, they kind of... They're, they're together. And, yeah, I and, and 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 I like and again these are my two favorite characters. So for them to yeah. for me to for them to be together for me yeah. is is you know is really pretty cool. cool. I mean, let's see what happens now because you know I mean we pretty much said it. Nick and and Salazar are gonna live somehow. 
Um, yeah, they're gonna live. You know what though? Before we before you just move on with that thought, I don't want to cut you off with that. It'll make you lose it. But I just want to say like this this season was really a return to form for these characters. So Strand yeah. went back to being Strand. Daniel's gone back to being Daniel. That's Nick's true. gone back to being Nick. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, well, well, let me ask you this: since we're getting into past your you know your past and how how people are evolving and how these characters are evolving, what do you think of uh, Madison's? Um, dream sequences of the Christmas. okay so there th- that's where i wanted to go next i was gonna yeah. ask you what did you think of the little in- home homemaker intervals um yeah i mean <laughs> i mean they were cool for yeah. what they were but i, I was like well, what, do you, what do you think it meant i what do you think it meant? i all right, so as they're going on i'm hearing the sounds right and i'm hearing that washing and that whooshing sound i'm like and i turn to my wife and i'm like i guarantee she's gonna be like I just I figured something was gonna happen. I figured something was gonna she was gonna be in water or buy water, and it was gonna mm-hmm. it was gonna at some point towards the end it was gonna transition to it being like oh this is where she's been the whole time we've been seeing this is in her thing. Then we yeah. get a cameo from Travis, and we see at the end how she's in the water, which by the way is one of the coolest shots I've ever done on the show, of her being in that water yeah. and like the murkiness like. That was mm-hmm. cool. I really enjoyed that. So again, that's what I assumed. All of that took place in this short amount of time that she was under the water and possibly drowning. Okay. And then she has this, this vision of Travis that saves her. But yeah, that was just her psyche, basically her life flashing before her eyes, essentially. Yeah, that's, I agree. And, and like, again, I assume that's what that was the entire time, yeah. you know? Yeah. Well, her and her and, um, uh, Madison and Strand mentioned, um, that when they were talking on the dam before the attack, how you know Madison can cook a real good turkey or whatever she said and well that's and, uh, yeah exactly I enjoyed you know I enjoyed cooking for the holidays I enjoyed that, like that right so, so that was the whole point yeah yeah it's it's to me I, I took it as all right now this is you know that, that those great holiday meals and all these kind of things were such a great part of of the of the world before the apocalypse and that now you know um, you you can't necessarily have that and there's there's a new um, you know, this is a whole new world, and and they mentioned, you know, we're not going to ha- remember the Bible, we're not going to remember, um, um, you know, that the past, and uh, with her walking with and seeing the gravestones and seeing uh, Alicia's name on the gravestones and things, I kind of oh, got yeah. that that feeling of of um, uh, you know, that she definitely. Uh, she she knows she'll never get to that again, and that's why when she lifts the cover to the meal and there's the the, the head or whatever it was. That's what I'm or, saying it was like everything that was yeah that, that has happened to her yeah. and everything that's going on and the fact that mm. again she was basically dying yeah. drowning yeah that's and then what, l- listen and then at the end when she does come out of the water and mm-hmm. she sees this little girl and what does water give us what do we what what happens to us if we don't have water. You know, right. Well, water we supp- died. Right, and water's you know supposed I mean? to symbolize it's life. Life, exactly. But wait, so, but wait. She sees this young, this young girl, and she sees these people that um, that are that are now blessed, uh, essentially, because now the dam is 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 bringing all this water. Um, to That's the an people. interesting point. I didn't think of yeah. it that way. You know what I yeah. thought? I thought, wow, look at all the dead body and debris inside this water, <sighs> and these people are putting it in. Mikey, not not clean buckets. They're yeah. they literally uh, were well, put, dumping shit buckets. Ho- hopefully, they boil it, dude. Dude, <laughs> I thought that too. But didn't dude. didn't Proctor say that? Or because when they were rolling up, when Alicia and them were rolling up on the on the those boats, there was there was bodies floating, and I think that's when he was kind of saying he said something to Strand like. Why are there, you know, bodies? Of Why are there dead bodies in like the water that, that I'm supposed to? Yeah, yeah, something like that. So. Yeah, it's 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 really funny because um, not to go not to go off, but we always worried so much about the Walking Dead and, and the infected and can you eat the meat and the tainted meat episodes with with Bob and all these kind of things and and it's just so funny how <laughs> not necessarily that they're careless in this show, but um, they take a lot more chances. You know, look at the like you said with the gland with the drug that they were taking and. Um, you know the 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 drug dealer. I forgot what we call it, what what his name was. The Matador or whatever the hell he was. Yeah. But just how he knew from experience that all right, this is the one that could, you know, fuck you up because the virus is already, you know, too 
you know, yeah. the, the, the walk was was dead for, for for too long. But I just always I just think that's so crazy. And it, the, like you just said, with the bodies floating in the water, it's just like, you know, I guess you it takes a lot more than we ever expected by walk, watching The Walking Dead that you can get sick. Um, you know. I mean, there it's I mean, everyone's infected anyway, so it's not. Yeah. It's like, but what if it's already in you? It's mm-hmm. really just something that's going to make you essentially die, like sick and die. Mm. Like, it's yeah, it's a weird, it's a weird thing. That's why it's yeah. not really ever really explained. It's because it, they have yeah. to leave it vague. Otherwise, you start getting too scientific, and they're gonna people are gonna punch holes right through it. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, I, what just, else we got? I'm I, I just I, we're gonna be wrapping this up, I guess. I just um I just want a comment well, is yeah. they gave us two new two new locales and we lost both of them in this one season. We got the the ranch and then we got the dam and we lose them both. I mean, I thought that was kind of cool. Like I, you know, like I like how they. It just always happens. Yeah. You never you, in both worlds. Exactly. Well, not, that's what in both shows. That's what that's yeah. what that's what we sh- we should learn is that. And which is which is so frustrating for mm-hmm. all of these characters in their lives is like, damn it, can't we just freaking stay in one place without some dumb I shit guess happening? That you would know? make that would maybe make a boring show. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, if one you were season. always, yeah, it, it, I would, I would, I wonder how that would how that really would play out. If say, for instance, you know, we have in in either show, if you have our main cast and they're fortified and they're in this place, and really all you have to worry about is. Uh, maybe a horde or uh, a stray group here and there. I wonder, you know, how that would be for us as viewers if we are in Alexandria for three seasons or or from now until the show ends or something like that. I'm just wondering how how can you really make um, for an exciting show if you're always just in that one place? Right. Yeah. You always you always need that drama, but I don't want to forget about what do we think um, happened to Stran and Delicia. Um, on the boat at the end. I mean, if if what you know, if if Madison think, made it yeah, out, I, I mean, think, you think they're all gonna pop up? You yeah, think that I think yeah, they're gonna. Alicia pop up. Strand will pop up. Yeah, they're gonna pop. Up. I mean, I can see maybe Strand well, going. I can kind of see his his character kind of being at its at its end. Um, yeah, well, we thought that already this season. That didn't. Yeah, happen, but you so. know what? I mean, I, for 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 such a, a catastrophic. Um, situation to go down with 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 the band with the the dam blowing up and right listen uh, nick and and Talzar are, are still on top of the dam so for them to survive which i'm assuming they will survive uh it's going to be very difficult for us to have don't you think it would be odd for all of them to survive this no Strand, no Richard, not at all madison? because it's... we know madison lives no i don't so think so i think someone what I don't think so. I don't think it's going to be weird. It's just going to be this is the group now. I just and don't think it's forget, unbelievable. We have Taka, and you had um, I keep forgetting Mad Dog. What's his name? Crazy Dog. Crazy right? Dog. Yeah, they kind of jumped in and helped out a little. I bit. I mean, that was kind of cool. I enjoyed yeah. that. I enjoyed seeing yeah. them. I like. I you know what? I like those characters. Those characters I like. Not, well, well. Do you think that they are? Um, were you upset that they left? Well, I don't think they left left. I kind of think that they were like, let's let's well, they, just move away now. And they're not. I feel okay. So I feel like Strand and Alicia got picked up by Walker and Crazy mm-hmm. Dog. They're gonna pick up. They're gonna pick up uh, Madison, mm-hmm. um, Nick and and Daniel. I don't. You know, I couldn't tell you what's gonna happen with them yet. You know, yeah. I mean, I'd have to think on it more. But you yeah. know, I think they're gonna end up doing something. And then you have John. You have Proctor John now. I, <laughs> Let's talk about Proctor John real quick because there's this big thing where the you know producers are like, oh, you know, there's going to be a crossover between the two series. Mm-hmm. And what's interesting is that at this point, it it, it 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 looks like it might be Abraham. And it's funny because I'm thinking, what characters? Those, those are the rumors that are floating. What around. characters? Right. What characters are going to be? I'm like, it has to be someone that's dead. And I think it's going to be. I always I I initially thought it's going to be Abraham. Then all of a sudden, I started seeing all these articles online about, oh yeah, it's going to because he mentions going to Texas. Yeah. Right, and so I'm like, all right, so um, yeah, I th- so I think the theory is that it's going to be Abraham. It's got to be a Walking Dead character because, like we mentioned last week, if it's a fear, the if it's a fear character, you're just giving away. The but it's going to be dead. It's the, it's going to be a character that's not on the show anymore. That's yeah. the whole point. And so, how many of those do we have? How many of those do we care about? 
Mm -hmm. So I again, I did process of elimination, and I figured it was Abraham, and I think that's what they're going to do. But you know what? That's fine. It's not that big of a. It, it, look, it'd be great to see it'll boost, it'll, it's, again. It's like a little boost of ratings. I think yeah. that's something that they had in their pocket in case they like what's going on is that the ratings are really not good for fear. Right. That's something that they, they kept in their pocket to say, hey, listen, and, you know, let's throw Abraham. Let's throw uh, Eugene. Let's throw uh, like you mentioned last week. Uh, what if the um, what if Negan, you know, was yeah, that? Right. Was, you know what I mean? So they always had that. They, they always had that um, little ace card, yeah, just in case. Yeah, and obviously they're using it. Yeah, well, you yeah. know, I mean, it'll be, it'll be, you know, it, I mean, yeah. again, it'll be good yeah. to see him again. So, uh, yep. uh, one last thing, they use the f bomb. <sighs> they did, right? Yeah, she says to him, "It was after he after he killed." No, no, no. Well, yeah, it was when they were in that room hiding out. And he's he's talking shit to her. Or was it in the dam? I don't remember when it was, but she says, fuck you. She <laughs> says to Nick, he says some dumb shit to her. And she's like, fuck you. I was like, oh, damn, F-bomb. All right. Yeah, all right. I thought I heard that. I thought I heard that. I was like, crap. So, okay. <laughs> Good. Good for you. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know, man. It was, is Troy still alive? No. No. Troy's gone. Really? Because Daniel gone. was gone, we thought. Yeah, but Troy got uh, Troy got a fucking ball bean hammer to the head. That's okay. You know? Daniel was burned alive. Yeah, I mean, unless he somehow escaped before the the bomb went off. Here's how it goes: the, the water off. woke him up. He got up. He got out, and he's gonna show up. I'm I'm I, my guess is he's gonna. That's my theory. He's gonna. Wow, show up. I didn't even think of that. I just I pretty much. Um, it's classic. It's classic trope. Yeah. Classic, could. you know, it could. dramatic. It could. But now, the how? I, I don't know. That would be kind of. I don't know about that. The point is, do you care? Not really. <laughs> I was okay. I was okay with him going right there. And I, I mean, like I said, I think that this is the show is coming up to. Uh, we mention this all the time. The show is this. The show is is. It, it's very difficult to to now know where they're going to go because I don't necessarily think they know where they're going to go because just it's not. For the writers of the show, it's not living up to the expectation, I don't think, anymore. We always say how a lot of these characters, it's very cyclical. They're doing the same thing over and over and over. Everybody's reverting or or they're evolving into someone that they've been now for a couple seasons, and that's kind of who they are. Like That's why I think Stran is gone. Uh, I think Strand might be like he washes up or they see his body or something like that. Or I think Strand is kind of – how much – how much more his redemption was 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 it's, allowing it's them to escape? Right, it's gone and passed. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I think he's kind of I think he's kind of done. I can either say this is my little theory. I I think that either um, Strand and Daniel will 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 die because I just think it's going to be way too ridiculous if they all survive this. This dam was supposed to explode and, and it did explode, but but for all them to to make it i think it would just be ri- ridiculous right. so i can i can either say one or the other or both strand and and yeah. and, and, and salzar but i say i say they're all i'm, le- I'm leaning more towards um strand dying i think his time is out uh, is over i mean i look i agree with that but i still think they're all alive even troy all right well we'll see <laughs> next year we'll see next season when they it comes all back still what alive. happens but yeah anyway yeah. uh so that's it uh I guys that's, wh- i think that's about it we that, didn't forget anything that, right? I'm done. it's over can we you know <laughs> look it was but good we it. yeah we made it it was a we decent finale it. you know i um we made it a tree you yeah a tree you uh, made it. Artek, he's back. <laughs> Artek made it back. Artek, so if Artek maybe, made it back, Troy can make it true. back. And, and so he was Strand. in quicksand. That's so. true. All right. Um, that's true. Anyway, guys, let us know what you thought of this finale. Uh, again, it was good. It was all right. It was. It was. Uh, it's hard to say, and it's good, but it was. It was good for what it was, and um, definitely one of the better episodes. Is I think they were too. I agree. I think they were probably the better, the best too. Still, you know, it's like good stuff mixed in with some really dumb stuff. It's like, it's like, that's the problem. Anyway, yeah. Let's digress. Let's let's end this thing, guys. Thanks so much for watching, Mikey. If they're not watching and they're just listening, curse you. 
<laughs> you're not watching. The only, the only. Uh, no, we yeah, like listen. We like listeners too. You can listen too. You can listen. You don't want to see our ugly can. mugs. You don't have to. You can just you hear can our, listen our to our us on voices. What? What, where can they find us, Chris? They can find us on Tell iTunes. Uh, yes. iTunes. I like to say iTunes. iTunes. Our third person, of course, on 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 iTunes. But of course, we love the feedback that we can get from the Facebook platform and the YouTube platform. So just write your comments below what you think, um, how you uh, how you really graded um, our reactions for this for this season of Fear. We were very hard on it. We all were, dude. Ev- all of us. All of you there, guys, there too. Was, we were uh, all so Nicholas, hard on it. Nicholas, shout out for us. Uh, he's been leaving comments, and he's been explaining how much he enjoys us but can't stand the show, which is very yep. cool. Kid Slap's been in here a bunch of times, I believe. Yes. Yeah, so, yes. of course, yeah. Uh, we, we love the comments. We're going to be getting to those comments. I know that some of us... Um, we haven't so we answered have all the comments. I, it's so been a, it's we'll, been a long we'll, week, yeah. yeah, we'll we'll get to those. But of course, check us out on Facebook. Check us out on the Instagrams. We've been trying to, you know, Chris put up a lot of cool Comic Con stuff, and we got the Walking Dead coming back finally this weekend. So we're gonna be putting some cool Walking Dead um, fun stuff on the Instagram as well. Those but of those course, mashups, dude, are hilarious. Oh, uh, dude, did you see the last one with um, <laughs> yeah. Glenn and uh, Matt? Is it and Maggie? It, yeah. Dude, Glenn, th- those are yeah. cool, man. Oh my god, yeah. If you guys, cool. if so you guys aren't checking check those out, up. you got to You got to check those yeah. out because they're 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 so funny, man. It is fun. I got a few more too, so I'm gonna be putting them up. Uh, probably uh, one for the next uh, next day until uh, one each day until yeah, there you go. Walking Dead comes. Just just but get yeah. up, uh, go look at that. Go on our Instagram, yeah, go, go check, check it out. out. They're Third so funny, pod. man. They're so yeah, funny. Yeah, they're they're really fun. Um, yeah, and that guys, that's it. I think I think we're, that's gonna do it. Um, yeah. If you guys. Uh, if you guys wouldn't mind checking out Retro Squat, my other podcast, yes. you can go to RetroSquat.com or, or any of the socials, um, or you can get it on iTunes or Google Play or on Stitcher or on, uh, yeah, I got it up on all those things. And uh, yeah, go check it out. It's a fun it's a fun thing. Uh, it's, a, it's a cool little retro yeah. podcast where we mash mash up things. And it's, it's fun. Check that out. Guys, thank you so much. Next week, The Walking Dead Returns, episode yeah, 100. Episode 100. Yep, really, uh, really excited for that. Uh, it's really, we're gonna yeah. really get into that. Um, yeah, so we're looking forward to it. So, guys, thanks so much Absolutely. for sticking around with us on the Fear of the Walking Dead. Yeah, thank you, and we will see you <laughs> next episode. Peace, Peace out.